and this is the Druk Wangal Shorten. We're here on the road between Timpu and Ganti in Bhutan. A little overcast sky out there. The Druk Wangal Shorten. In case you didn't already know, a Shorten or Stupa is a monument, a shrine symbolizing Buddha's presence. And there are 108 of these Chortons in the Dochula Pass, a mountain pass at 10,200 feet in the snow-covered Himalayas on the road from the city of Timpu to the city of Punaka. The official name, Druk Wangyal Shorten. Why are there 108 Chortons? Well, that's one for each of the 108 Bhutanese soldiers killed in a battle against thousands of Assam guerrilla insurgents from the country of India, hiding out in Bhutan. There was war, and I mean war between Bhutan and these Assam Indian guerrillas. As a backdrop for this battle story, three key points you need to know. Number one, India and Bhutan are friends and long-term trading partners. Number two, Assam is an Indian ethnic movement seeking independence for India's northeastern states. And finally, number three, India has been feuding with these Assam rebels since back in the 1970s. In fact, the Indian government started really cracking down on the Assam guerrilla rebels in 1990 inside of northeast India. These Assam rebels then jumped to a safe space inside southern Bhutan. Of course, no announcement was given to the Bhutanese. In any event, now the negotiation phase. King Jigmi Wangchuk of Bhutan made many, many unsuccessful attempts to get these Assam Indian guerrillas to leave Bhutan and was frankly repeatedly assured by them that they would leave. Ultimately, no success. Finally, Bhutan's king, Jigmi Wangchuk, led a Bhutanese army that violently dislodged the rebels from 30 camps in Bhutanese territory during what they called Operation All Clear. Now that was back in December 2003. Victory, <laughs> but at a cost of 108 Bhutanese lives. This is hallowed ground. On to the next temple, next door. Here's my guide Tara. So this is the Duk Wangal Lahang. So it's very new one, which was built, being built by the royal family in 2008. And it's mainly being built to bring the peace and happiness for the people living in the country. About a quarter mile from the Druk Wangyal Chortens is a monastery called Druk Wangyal Lakang. Now the word Lakang is simply temple, so the Druk Wangyal Lakang was built in honor of the fourth head of state of Bhutan, the aforementioned Jigmi Wangchuk. With the backdrop of pristine forests of snow-covered Himalayan mountains, the temple was initiated and completed back in 2008. This was built as a memorial to celebrate a hundred years of the monarchy here in Bhutan. Beautiful Bhutan. By the way, I'm told on a clear day you can see the Himalayas from right here. 